hello everyone you are welcome how to solve and find the value of this beautiful exponential math problem without any calculator which is 32 raised to power 5 minus 32 raised to power 4 how can we solve this math problem first of all here we can write this first term this power is 32 raised to power 5 can be written as 4 plus 1 minus 32 raised to power 4 and here in the first one term we will use an exponential identity so here in the first term we will use this one exponential identity we can write a raised to power m plus n as a raised to power m times a raised to power n so using this exponential identity here this first term will become this will become 32 raised to power 4 times 32 raised to power 1 or simply 32 minus 32 raised to power 4 now there is 32 raised to power 4 common in both the terms so we will take out common so this will become 32 raised to power 4 times it will become 32 minus 1 and next we can write this 32 as this can be written as 32 is same as 2 times 2 is 4, 4 times 2 is 8, 8 times 2 is 16, x 16 times 2 is 32. So 32 is same as 2 raised to power 5. So here we replace this 32 with 2 raised to power 5. How raised to power? We can write this 4 as 2 times 2 times it is simply 31. Here in this one number we will use another exponential identity. So here in this one number we will use this one exponential identity. We can write a raised to power m times n is a raised to power m whole raised to power n. So using this exponential identity here we multiply this two with this power and we will out this power two. So this number will become this will become two raised to power. 5 times 2 is 10 whole raised to power 2 times 31 and next we can write this number is 31 times 2 raised to power 10 whole raised to power 2 or square and we will try to find out the value of 2 raised to power 10 that what is the value of 2 raised to power 10 2 raised to power 10 is simply this can be written as 2 raised to power 5 plus 5 so using this exponential identity here we can write this as 2 raised to power 5 times 2 raised to power 5 here the value of 2 raised to power 5 is simply 32 so this will become 32 times 32 but we can write second 32 as the sum of 30 plus 2 now here we can very easily multiply this 32 with these two numbers so here 32 times 0 is 0 and 32 times 3 is 3 times 2 is 6 and 3 times 3 is 9 plus 32 times 2 is simply 64 now let us add these two numbers so 4 plus 0 is 4 6 plus 6 is 12 so this is 2 1 will be carried and 9 plus 1 is 10 so this is 1024 so the value of 2 to power 10 is 1024 and here we will replace this number with 1024 so this will become 31 times this is simply 1024 whole square here we have to find out the value of this number square so therefore next we can write this number as 31 times this can be written as the sum of 1000 plus 24 whole square now we will find out this value using a plus b whole square identity. So here in this step we will use this one a plus b whole square identity which is equal to a square plus b square plus 2 times ab. We're using this identity here this is our a and this is our b. So this number will become this is 31 times this will become 1000 square plus 24 square plus 2 times 1000 times 24 and we have to simplify this one number so this will become 31 times what is the square of 1000 it is simply 1 
million what is the value of 20 power square we will find out this value here we can write 20 power square as 24 times 24 but we can write second 24 as 20 plus 4 here we can easily multiply this with these two numbers so here 24 times 0 is 0 and 24 times 2 is 40 a this is 480 let us multiply this with 4 so 4 times 4 is 16 6 1 will be carried 4 times 2 is 8 8 plus 1 is 9 now let us add these two numbers so 0 plus 6 is 6 9 plus 8 is 17 7 1 will be carried to this one number 4 plus 1 is 5 so therefore the value of 20 power square is 576 so we will replace this with 576 plus now 2 times 24 is simply 48 48 times 1000 is simply 48000 so this will become 48000 here we will add these three numbers and then multiply the result with 31 so therefore this will become 31 times to add this number we will start from the ones position so 0 plus 6 plus 0 is simply 6 this is 0 0 plus 7 plus 0 is 7 0 plus 5 plus 0 is 5 next is 8 so 8 plus 0 is 8 4 plus 0 is 4 0 1 so here the addition of these three numbers gives him 1,048,576 here we have to multiply these two numbers without any calculator and without any standard multiplication so here we will write this number as the same 1,048,576 times and we can write this 31 as 30 plus 1 let's multiply this number first with 30 and second with 1 so it is very easy this number times 0 is 0 no, this number times 3 is you have to multiply this number with 3 so we multiply 3 with this number 3 times 6 is 18 8 1 will be carried 3 times 7 is 21 21 plus 1 is 22 2 2 will be carried 3 times 5 is 15 15 plus 2 is 17 7 1 will be carried 3 times 8 is 24 24 plus 1 is 25 so 5 2 will be carried 3 times 4 is 12 12 plus 2 is 14 so 4 1 will be carried 3 times 0 is 0 0 plus 1 is 1 and 3 times 3 is 3 so here the front of this number times 30 gives him 31 million 457,280 plus now multiplying this number with 1 gives him this number is the same so this gives him 1,048,576 now so finally we will add these two numbers that will be our final answer now to add these two numbers we will start from the ones position so 6 plus 0 is 6 7 plus 8 is 15 so this is 5 1 will be carried to this one number 5 plus 1 is 6 6 plus 2 is 8 next is 8 so 8 plus 7 is 15 so 5 1 will be carried to the next digit 4 plus 1 is 5 5 plus 5 is 10 0 1 will be carried to this number 0 plus 1 is 1 1 plus 4 is 5 next is 1 so 1 plus 1 is 2 and 3 so here the addition of these two numbers gives him 32,505,856 so therefore the value of this implies the value of 32 raised to power 5 minus 32 raised to power 4 is 32,505,856 Six. So this is our final answer and our required target.